This is a getting started tutorial for the TI Innovator Hub and TI Inspire CX series calculator. In this session, we connect the TI Innovator Hub to the calculator and write a simple program to address the LED on board the Innovator Hub. The video aligns directly with the free 10 minutes of coding lessons available from the Texas Instruments website. Before we get started, make sure your calculator and Innovator Hub have the latest operating system installed. Instructions on how to check and update these are on the Texas Instruments website. The first step is to physically connect the calculator and Innovator Hub. Use the unit to unit cable that came with the TI Innovator Hub. The B end of the cable goes to the hub and the A end to the calculator. When they're connected properly, a small green LED on the Innovator Hub will turn on. Now you're ready to start programming. On the calculator, I'll create a new document and select Program Editor followed by New. I'll call this first program Light 1. The most efficient and effective way to program on the handheld is to use the menus. From the menu, select Hub followed by Send Set and then select Light. With the cursor still inside the quotation marks, Use the menu once again, select Hub, followed by Settings, and finally On. Still within the quotation marks, we'll set the time for 5 seconds. Use the same Settings menu as before. We're now ready to run our first program. Press Ctrl followed by R to run the program. A new page is added with the calculator application and our program name. Press Enter to execute. A small LED on the TI Innovator Hub will glow red. Check out the remaining steps in Skill Builder 1 for the TI Innovator Hub. With a little more programming, you can also make it blink. In the next tutorial, you'll see how to change the colour of the LED. That's all for this session. Make sure you finish off Skill Builder 1 from the free 10 minutes of code section of our website and subscribe to our channel to keep up to date as new tutorials are added to this series. Thanks for watching.